Hello guys, how are you all doing? So we are playing, we are continuing to play the Master Yi where we focus on getting our team ahead early through Press the Attack and Blue Smite Warrior and we focus on team fighting with shorter ultimate cooldowns. So the reasoning behind this current build is that split pushing just isn't as meta as it used to be. So Ravenous Hunter isn't as useful because... Man, she just, she's just going ham. She's just killing herself there. So it's just not as useful to run Ravenous Hunter. Now, if you guys don't know, Ravenous Hunter heals you off of your E, heals you off your Q, heals you off of Blood Razor, heals you off of all that stuff. So it's definitely very good, but I think it's a time to do some changing. So let's go ahead, get into the game, and we'll show you how to play. Okay, so something that you could do when you're doing a clear like this, guys, is you can bring, like, a sweeper early instead of your, uh, trinket. Like the, instead of the yellow trinket. Which will allow you to get some nice early, um, clears. Or, rather, ganks. Uh, because you never know when they might ward. So we're looking around. We want to start having a plan B. I'm dead. Rip. I honestly didn't really expect that. Even though I've done that cheese a billion times myself. Did not expect that. We're going to drop the pot by a thing. And here we go. We can swap our trinket like I had wanted. We're going to get red buff, level 3, and then we're going to gank top. you got to make the best out of a terrible situation, right? Right? I totally think we can do this. I don't think Kennen warded. I've been watching him on the minimap. I didn't see him ward. Alright, not sure about that one. Alright guys, so here I am. I'm buying the blue smite. It is acquired, and now we're going to run it down. <laughs> By run down, I mean I'm going to go to jungle, and then we're going to kill bot lane. Yeah, so we got to go help him. We're not going to have blue smite. But, um, we do have meditate, though, you know, he has a lot of stuns. I'm gonna let him take all that farm because I did get the kill. No biggie. If I didn't get the kill, I'd probably farm it. Alright, so we do have our ultimate up. Now we're gonna go make a move for top lane. We're gonna sweep it just to make sure he's not there. What? Are you kidding me? Oh, I couldn't meditate. Dude, unbelievable. He had his third knockup, man. Unbelievable. They have a LeBlanc? Oh, he was in dunk. Oh, oh. Oh, Darius is mad. Where'd he go? Like, he jumped that wall so fast. Oh, I thought that was real. Oh, I thought that was real. Oh, I thought that was real. I got debated. Just uh, attack clicking into there. Let's get some plates. I say we go for it. <laughs> Best dive ever. I'll take it. Well, let's keep going. Why not? Why not? Alright, so we got our items. Now let's start heading down towards that dragon. Zidzel might be in there alone. Yeah, he's definitely in there alone. I wish our bot lane had some prio! They're winning hard, but they're not defending dragon. They're winning hard, but they're not defending dragon. He's in there. Oh, they're not. Oh, he's not in there. I'm fed. We're going. Wait, is that a rift in the mid? Yo, somebody go stop that rift, Harold. I got dragon. Don't worry. I can't miss it. I can't miss it. I can't miss it. We do have enough for Ginzus. We probably want to go back for it. But we also have this full clear that we're working on. 
I mean, we might as well full clear and then use the time backing to let the camps respawn. I think a 14 minute Gunt is pretty much winnable for me here. We got 6 3 1. We're all leveling Zin Zhao, barely, but we are definitely out leveling him here. It's going really well. And on top of that, our ultimate hunter is getting pretty nicely stacked. And the dragon is a sky dragon, which means we can get our ultimate down to like. Well, like 40, 35 seconds or something like that. Because we're going to be able to get three of them. Okay, so we got this. Uh, let's take a look at their team comp. Oh. I mean, Mercs probably wouldn't be terrible here. Probably wouldn't be terrible. Um, I think I'm just going to go straight for the Death Dance. Some extra CDR for our ultimate. Can't complain about that. Can't complain about that at all. Uh, we're missing a kill on LeBlanc, which, of course, LeBlanc's one of the harder ones to get a kill on. So, it's kind of annoying. But, we got Vayne. Vayne's pretty hard to get a kill on, too. We got her. So, you gotta, you gotta be happy about that. You gotta be happy about that. Okay. Now we can go ahead and make a move for bot lane. So let's go. Um, well, let's wait in this bush. Oh, well, you know, there's a ward here. Let's not. Watch this, meditate bug, and we're good. Yeah, I probably, I probably shouldn't have flashed there, but it looked flashier. Get it, get it, flashier, flash. <laughs> um, so what we want to do is we do want to hit this rift, so we do fully stack Gunju's on it, and if they come to stop us, we just turn on them, right? Yeah, go ahead, sweep me. Oh, I alpha dude. I alpha Oh my god, I alpha Okay. Dude, did I ever tell you guys how much I hate Vayne as a champ? I actually really hate that champ. So let's go get that dragon for the alt cooldown, baby. That's how I like it. Let's get some of that alt cooldown. Because, like, look at this. We got all five kills now because we got LeBlanc. 51 seconds on an ultimate without any... Without anything, right? We don't have blue buff or sky dragon. 51 seconds. After we get this dragon, it should go down to, I believe, what, 56 seconds maybe? I don't know exactly how the additive works, but I'm pretty sure. Actually, well, let's see how it stacks with Ultimate Hunter. I don't know. If I didn't have Ultimate Hunter, I'd say 46. But since I do have Ultimate Hunter, maybe like 48. We'll see. Well, let's see. 44? It's only 10% all cooldown. 10% of 51 is 5, which is 46. What is this magic? This is not right. This is not right. It's clearly bugged. Clearly bugged. We need to report this to Rito immediately. That's 5.8. 6.8. We lost 6.8 seconds. Wow, it's pre-Ultimate Hunter. It's actually pre-Ultimate Hunter. 68 seconds is how much cooldown we have on Highlander without Ultimate Hunter. Oh, that is busted. Yo. That's really good. Well, let's go get ready for that Baron. We could totally do Baron if we wanted to. Ooh, he was an alpha. Hey, we got Vayne, boys. Winnable. Let's go get Baron. Baron time, boys. Baron time. Let's clean it up. Let's use decisive action here. Yo, actually, Callista has more kills than me. When did this happen? When did, when did this happen, guys? When did this happen? I just canceled my auto. Alright, so using the power of Gunzu's here, this shouldn't be too hard. Okay, team. Alright, good job guys, you got him, you got him. Hey, at the end of the day, they're just defending Baron, I guess. They th they know that I have this, right? They're like, oh yeah, Master has got this, no problem. No problem, we could just leave. All right, let's go back for the death dance. Well, we just gotta wait for Cass and then to decide he's done jungling. <laughs> and then we could do something. All right. 
Zinzel did a really good job of running away. I hope he's proud of that. I hope he's proud of that. He held on to his double. You saw that? He wanted to knock me up. He was holding on to that. He thought he was going to do it. No, no, no. No, no, no. I got a 12 kill Callista on my team, boys. But that's just how this uh, this works. That's how it works. You try to be as aggressive as early as possible using the build. And you just join as many team fights as possible. Ravenous Hunter. It's great for healing. It's pretty good. But nowadays it's a bit less meta, I think. Is what it is. Alright, let's go ahead and drop an honor on this uh, Darius for being such a good sport with me. And until next time.